In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the setup wizard in SportsPress. Now, the first time we installed SportsPress, we would have been taken to the setup wizard uh, automatically. Uh, we can also revisit it by clicking run the setup wizard in the dashboard. Now, if we hit in this notice already, uh, we can also visit d uh, slash WP admin slash admin.php question mark page equals SP hyphen setup as you see on the screen. Now we're going to go back to our dashboard and click run the setup wizard. So this takes us uh, to the welcome screen and we can click let's go. Now we're going to select a city in the same time zone as us. Uh, in this case I've selected Melbourne. Um, we're going to select a sport. We'll uh, just keep it as football and uh, the name of the main league as well as the current season which I'll say is 2018 slash 19. We'll click continue. Uh, now we're going to add the name of our home team and a rival team. We can always add more teams later. This is just going to be the first team that we're going to play against. Now we can add some players. So I'll just go ahead and add a few names here, as well as the name of a staff member and their position. Now we move on to the venue setup where we enter the name of the venue and the address. So I'm just going to say Essendon and we can drag the map around as well as the pin to find the exact location of the venue. Now we have an option of creating additional pages like a calendar, a league table, and a player list. If we want these pages, we'll click continue or we can skip this step. I'm going to click continue. A bunch of demo uh, content has been added to our site and we can go and check it out or we can schedule our first event. I hope that tutorial has been helpful. Uh, feel free to check out our other videos on the Theme Boy YouTube channel. See you next time.